Okay, thanks for that opening call from Limerick, uh, Martin. And now it's me for, uh, for race 14 on you, Kyle. It's a two-mile national flat race here at NAS. It's number one is King Hall Palace. Two is Nickelback. Three, Rither Skythers. Four, Skylarker. Five, Clockwork. Six, Dem Mother. Seven, Frosty Flame. Eight, Loud Cookie. Miss PK is nine. Montana is ten. Robin Clark is eleven. Rough Silk is twelve. Samoan Eyes is thirteen. And Tina Turner is fourteen. So, they're off. Uh, this two mile flat race. And it's Frosty Flame that leads us. Frosty Flame by the couple to Nickelback with the Skyvers and Kinghorn Palace against the fence. They've been followed through by Loud Cookie and Clockwork. One on the outside making some ground is some Moen Eyes. Black and Gold Silks. They've been followed through by. Oh, clockwork's dropped back a little bit there. Rough Silk, Skylarker, up against the fence along with Miss PK. Outside of that now is moving around a lot. Rough Silk, clockwork's dropped right back, and Tina Turner at the rear, but up front, which is going to be easier to call because he's on his own, it's Frosty Flame. Frosty Flame by a couple of links to Kinghorn Palace and River Skythers. Samoa Nice. Miss PK's done well on the inside to get up into a as a uh, share of third place and they're being followed through by Montana Den Mother in the yellow and the outside of that is the Montana back on the inside we've got Nickelback and the uh, Norwegian Silks of Clockwork uh, against the fences Skylarker Skylarker they go past the winning post here at NAS the circuit to go and it's still Frosty Flame that leads us up front a couple of lengths to Kinghorn Palace and Miss PK. And Lau Cookie had nowhere to go there. One at the rear of uh, Kinghorn Palace. One that's moved out well outside is some Moen Eyes for Moilets. And now Loud Cookie's got a little bit of space and starts to challenge for the leading uh, leader of the pack. Also out, out on the outside now comes Clockwork again. It's gone from first to last to first, well not first, but into the challenge. The one in yellow on the outside is Dem Mother. The inside of that is Skylarker. There's Robin Cook, Samoa Noise has dropped back down again. The pack's chopping and changing all the time. The one that's getting a little bit caught for toe at the rear is Tina Turner. He's just a length behind Nickelback. But still up front with six furlongs left to run. It's still Frosty Flame from the rest. A chasing pack being led by Loud Cookie and Kinghorn Place Palace and Clockwork. I think Frosty Flame is a Paul Rhodes horse. Darren Howe's Loud Cookie's in second. Darren Thompson's River Skyther's comes out of nowhere and puts Frosty Flame under a bit of pressure at four furlongs out. So it's Frosty Flame and River Skyther's. Frosty Flame heads for home again. The jockey asks for more and he gets it. Starts to pull away. The grey Robin Clark for Graham Clutterbuck also comes out of the pack now and starts to put down a challenge. But it's Frosty Flame that still leads us as we hit the three furlong pole. It's Frosty Flame by a couple of lengths to Robin Clark. Then we've got River Skyther's on the fence. Loud Cookie, Rough Silk and Clockwork are all still there. They've been followed through by Kinghorn Palace, Montana and Miss PK and Samoan Eyes. But it's up front. It's Frosty Flame from Robin Cook as they're inside the two now. Frosty Flame under challenge now by the grey Robin Clark. Robin Clark just starts to nose in front. These two lead. But only a length back to River Sky. There's Clockwork and Rough Silk. But they've got a lot to do. We're inside the final furlong. It's Robin Clark by half a length to... Frosty Flame. Robin Clark still hanging on. Frosty Flame's got the font fence to help with hit the wire now. And it's Robin Clark that's going to take this. Ends up winning it by a length from Frosty Flame in second. I think River Skyvers was third. There's a win there for Graham Clutterbuck. It's the uh, flat race of the week, the bumper. And it is Robin Clark that takes it from Frosty Flame in second. River Skyvers was third. So Graham Clutterbuck wins Robin Clark. Second was Frosty Flame for Thunderspark. Sorry if I called that as a Paul Rhodes horse. Third was River Skyvers for D. Thompson. Fourth was Clockwork for Carl Arrogante. And fifth was Kinghorn Palace for Jim Murray.